Hey friends, this is Cindy Blair, I'm one of the educators at the Alexandria Museum of Art, and I'm bringing you your Art Therapy Thursday. And I'll tell you what, this week I really need it too. I think um, I'm filming this on Wednesday, it's Wednesday, <laughs> and um, it really feels like it should be Friday or Friday at midnight, I don't know, <laughs> it's really been, I'm sure that a um, few of you out there are feeling the same way, um, maybe your stress level is kind of high right now. I invite you with me today, because I need it too, <laughs> to take a minute, um, this is going to be a short one today, and um, we're going to do a mindfulness drawing exercise from the um, Drawing Your Own Path book, I'm gonna show you, by John Simon. And um, he is actually an artist in our permanent collection. Um, he is a pioneer in um, multimedia sort of e-art, uh, computer art. Um, it's really fascinating stuff. Um, but he has a sort of a um, Buddhist mindful, mindfulness drawing practice and um, that he's been doing every day for, I think, 20 years. Um, but he wrote a whole book about it, and uh, we're going to do just the first exercise. So um, just what you need for this is a pencil or something to draw with. It doesn't have to be a pencil. It can be a crayon. It can be whatever you have to make marks with and um, a piece of paper. Um, the more sort of casual type piece of paper it is, the better, but that's your choice. So if you have an envelope you want to scribble on the back of, um, whatever you have to make marks on, that's good. So you need a mark making implement and something to make marks on. That's all you're going to need today. So, um, gather those materials, sit back, take a deep breath, and we're going to get started. Okay. So I have decided to set up in my backyard today and um, I have a piece of paper. Remember, this is a sketchbook, but it can be anything. Um, and I just have a Sharpie marker, but again, you can use anything. Okay, so this is gonna be different for some of you guys. This is an art exercise where we're not worried about the final product. We're worried about we're not worried about anything actually, it's art therapy. <laughs> but we are thinking about doing something that impacts the way we feel instead of having a final product as, um, as our goal. So the first thing I want you to do is take a deep breath. And let it out. I want you to keep breathing. And we're going to take our writing implement, we're going to lay it down on the page, and just let your hand relax, and just start making marks, any kind of marks. I want you to let go of judgment, I want you to draw as if you were a child. make marks. No one has to see this. This is just for you. So that was about a minute. Um, we 
are going to now I want you to have a look at um, what you just done and I want you to um, consider what that experience was like for you I want you to think about how it felt um, was it easy for you to get into was it easy for you to let go or did it take a minute or two for you to get into it did you find yourself pausing at any point don't judge that it's just what it is just kind of sort of own what the experience was for you um, and you know do you kind of like what you ended up with or how do you feel about it um, and just sort of accept that whatever it is just sort of accept it and when you try this again we're gonna, you're gonna do it for a minute um, I recommend doing it more than once <laughs> and um, accept what it's like for you and, and that's okay um, moving forward okay so you don't have to show anybody what you did but just full disclosure that's what I ended up with and um, what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna extend the exercise just a little bit I'm gonna go for about four more minutes or you can just go as long as you want but um, I'm choosing three colors um, choose some colors that make you feel good um, I really like these colors and I kind of love that red and blue together so that's just what I'm choosing now this is an extension of the John Simon um, sort of mindful drawing technique in the first exercise of his book but um, I've done this before with um, veterans groups and found it to be really kind of relaxing and fun so go for another four minutes or for however long you'd like to I'm gonna set a timer for four minutes right now and um, I'm just gonna add some color to the doodle that I made and I feel really excited that I've chosen outside today because it's fabulous and again with this you don't want to think too much about it you just want to do it I mean maybe you've done something like this when you were little I remember we wrote our names in cursive and then we colored inside the loops God, that's like that was a super long time ago it was grade school so I don't know that was a while ago I just had that memory If you're able to be outside, you can, as you're drawing and co coloring, listen to the birds, listen to all the layers of sound. I'm hearing cars in the background, birds. bugs <sighs> just keep breathing keep breathing okay that was about an extra four minutes so that's kind of where I ended up. Now if I wanted to, I could just let it go and move on. And um, I actually feel a lot better. <laughs> but um, I think I'm going to stop it here. And then maybe later on I'm going to go back to it. Because I kind of really like the way it's looking. Um, so. And um, yeah. So we're going to finish right here. And just with one more deep breath. Hey, I hope that was relaxing for you and I know it was for me I actually feel a lot better <laughs> so um, let us know what you think and um, if there's any kind of relaxing art activity that you guys might have in mind let us know um, you can let me know drop me a comment and or, or send me a message on Facebook however you want to do that um, but just make sure that you um, like and share and subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our Facebook page. <laughs> um, we are hoping to keep bringing you more and more of um, the 
these really super relaxing activities just to kind of we've all got to stay sane right now guys <laughs> do the best you can anyway um hope you guys are well please take care and i'll see you again soon bye